Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So this reading will be for you if you have Gemini as your sun, moon, Venus, rising or north node, or if you're dealing with a Gemini, okay guys? If this reading doesn't resonate with you, please check your other placements. If you don't know your birth chart, just go through my channel. Doesn't matter if it's Gemini, it could be any sign, whatever title stands out to you and really feels like that's for you, very likely there's a message in there for you, okay guys? So definitely do that if this, if this does not resonate. All right, Gemini's. Oh, I just heard critical. Okay. Could be in a situation that's quite um, very challenging. Um, emotions are running high. You're not sure where you stand. What the next move to make. If you even want to be where you are right now um i'm not sure if this is in regards to your health or in regards to your workplace you know your, your career your your relationship relationships i'm getting a tower moment kind of energy where that there's a lot of chaos around you right now and you're really trying to find the calm find the reasoning to all of this What's the purpose? What is the lesson? What's the messages? What am I, what am I supposed to learn? That's what I'm getting. Okay. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up, guys. Comment if it resonates. I'm doing personal readings, okay? So just um, email me or you could um, find me on um, Instagram, Gigi's Tarot page. All the information's in the description box below, by the way, guys, okay? Gemini's. I'm seeing a heated argument. I haven't even pulled any cards yet, but I'm seeing a heated argument. Um, you could be witnessing this, or this could be you. Um, somebody coming towards you, or you, you um, confronting somebody about something. This may have happened already. This may be happening, or you expect this may happen. I just heard there's about two, three people that you may, um, that you kind of want to, that you either want to talk to them or they want to speak to you about something. It's going to be different for all of you. So for some of you, it could be a partner, ex-partner, family, friends. It could be at work. It's about two or three people that want to have this conversation. Um, if okay so if you are confronted do your best to keep calm okay because i feel like whoever this is they want a reaction out of you they want to it's almost like they're trying to prove a point gemini okay so there's definitely people i have to be honest there's definitely people speaking about you gemini and i feel like somebody may have um told them their version of these events that's happened and they they're just listening to that person they're not understanding your point of view or your experience with whatever's happened yeah you're deaf like whoever this is that's going to confront you they're going to go back to that person who it's about and they're going to say yeah you're right gemini is like that gemini is does behave that way so I don't know what it is if, if it's to do with court if it's to do, it could be anything guys so please know that this may be coming towards you for some of you it has happened already so you're fully aware um do your best to keep your calm and to um to really not allow these people to anger you okay because i do feel like it's a very um it's something that's affected you, that's affected them. And somebody wants to speak about it, okay? So just please try your best to stay calm and to um, avoid avoid um, arguments or confrontation, okay? Even if it does get heated, say, look, I can see we're both, you know, upset can we speak about it when we've calmed down because you know i don't want to fall out or i don't want this i don't you know i don't want us to be in this place okay 
Okay, all right, tell me about Gemini. So we have the Knight of Swords. So like I said, somebody's going to come and tell you something. They don't want to talk to you about something, yeah? Um, it could be another air sign, okay? Uh, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Or it could be you, like I've said, guys. Ace of Cups. It's got something to do with somebody who um, either you love, they love, or is very much loved, okay? Could be a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And uh, the Magician. So it could be an Aries. Why do I get like somebody's been stirring the pot? I just saw somebody, like, like a cauldron, someone stirring something. Gemini, someone's stirring something. Now, this could literally be, I don't know. This can, be, this can mean many things, right? It can mean many things. It could be somebody is just talking shit. Like just trying to make this person or these people more angered towards you. This could be some, this could, this person could literally be a cook or something like that. Or, you know, and literally that's what they do. They're in the kitchen cooking away. Yeah, it could be many different things. But please take it how it resonates. It's going to be different for you, for all of you. But emotions are going to run high. Okay. The emotions are definitely going to run high because there's something to do with love. Like somebody is either a person or a thing. I don't know. Okay let's move on okay please tell me more about gemini's what do gemini's need to know what do gemini's need, need to know okay so um i'm getting that you need to clear your mind you need to do things that help your um I feel like some of you guys are quite worked up worked up about whatever's going on. It's so important that you um, focus that energy on yourself, not others or the situation. Don't feed into it. Uh, make sure that you are okay first, okay? I don't know what it is that's going on, guys, but I feel like you two are angered. You two feel... Sorry. You two feel... You also feel like um, you're ready, like let's go let's go let's go okay so i'm feeling the need to to let you guys know to calm okay because it won't go anywhere it's like tit for tat i'm getting tit for tat okay it really needs to keep keep your calm somebody's trying to wind you up and they want you to be in that state don't allow them to somebody's going to say things and do things that's going to wind you up and trigger you gemini let me know if it's happened already because some of you's happened some of you guys this may happen or you you're thinking about it where you're going to be in a certain situation and people might bring the worst out of, of you show them that you are not that show them that you you don't have to be that way you may have argued with this person in the past all right, please tell me more about um they may have argued with you okay three of pentacles yeah just say look guys can we work as a team can we try to like you know really try it, it, this could be work as well it doesn't it's going to be different for everybody so i can't say yes at work this is no no it's not like that it's a general reading so it's for the collective it's going to be different for you all but i'm feeling that you guys need to work as a team right now something something requires teamwork something requires you putting aside um animosity you them someone needs to put that aside and work together as a team in order to be successful to achieve certain things i don't know what it is i keep saying but i feel that energy you will know what it is you will understand what i'm talking about um please tell me more about gemini's what would you like gemini's to know king of wands for some of you it's about a fire sign okay it's about um it could be about a leo sagittarius aries or somebody who's quite who comes off as quite confident maybe a bit cocky at times 
somebody who's a go-getter this person could be like here one minute they're the next very good looking person though whoever this is very good looking person um and they know it they know it they may use their charm this person's quite charming yeah this person's a charmer and ooh. okay all right so i'm getting that somebody some of you guys are dealing with the aries so this thing keeps on moving a bit it's annoying me some of you guys are do, dealing with the aries um if you don't know the birth chart i bet you they have aries in their chart okay um so this person this i feel like for some of you i'm gonna have to focus on this because this is what's coming up first for some of you it is to do with a love interest okay it's somebody who's quite flirty and they're not making it clear what things are what things are not i get somebody stringing somebody along and putting them in problems because this king of wands even if it's a female doesn't matter okay it's just the energy they're not making clear to different people where they stand what's going on doesn't have to be a fire sign like i said okay just think about what i've said and, and how this person's behaving think about the actions okay all right so we have <clears throat> wow okay that actually was in reverse so be, okay so the strength you need to be strong right now you need to resist you need to put yourself first you need to um focus your energy on yourself somebody is not choosing something or deciding something you have to pick yourself and i will forever say that i will forever say that male or female okay i will forever say that so seven of pentacles in reverse somebody doesn't want to work on this anymore somebody sees that nothing's coming of this situation there's no growth here okay it's almost like it's almost like they're just feeding into it just for the sake it's like, like in vain is what i'm getting somebody's doing something in vain energy in vain all this hard work in vain for what for nothing okay is what i'm getting three of swords in reverse so i feel like um if this is put the story how it fits in your life okay guys so i feel like with the three of swords in reverse it's somebody coming out of heartbreak and realizing wow you strung me along you messed around with me you made me feel like this was the case when it really wasn't like and you're seeing it clearly for what it is yeah and you guys will get over this you absolutely will get over it yeah i've got queen of wands at the bottom of the deck you guys are realizing that i don't need this person i don't need this this type of energy around me i don't need that this is not what i'm here for Right, one more card for um gemini's please please remember to give the video a, th a thumbs up guys one more card for gemini what would you like them to know wow you're gonna like this gemini i know you're gonna like this ten of pentacles something's gonna work in your favor i feel like it will work in your favor if you do not rise to like don't rise to whatever this person is trying to bring towards you okay guys do not make sure you keep your calm okay i don't know what it is you need to keep your composure is what i'm getting okay you're going to be blessed you're going to be rewarded okay some of you are gonna it's like a new home uh, there's more stability around you where things are a bit rocky before you will be gaining more stability remember what i've said guys if you need to watch this reading again please watch it because honestly it's sometimes you know we're like okay you know we're so focused on some things you may miss something so please if you need to watch it again please watch it again guys when you do those things that i've said throughout the reading stability okay so it might take a long time okay it might take a little while whatever is long to you don't expect it to happen straight away be patient be very patient okay and just take time to look at things how um to get into that virgo kind of energy you know where you analyzing things and looking at things and and trying to make things um choose the best options the best way to do things okay and that's what the knight of pentacles does in his journey okay he's not rushing like like the knight of swords or, or king of, um or um, knight of wands 
okay he's, he's actually he's much he's the slowest moving uh knight but you know what he gets the job done because he turns into the king of pentacles okay and um that's definitely something to work towards that people want so i'm going to leave it there guys i truly wish you guys the best and i hope everything works out for you in your favor okay i love you and leave you have an amazing week and i'll see you guys in your next reading bye guys